Hey, Chandler. Monica just broke my seashell lamp. Neat. I'm gonna die alone. <laughs> okay, you win. Chandler, you are not gonna die alone. Janice was my safety net, okay? And now I have to get a snake. Uh-huh. Why is that? If I'm gonna be an old, lonely man, I'm gonna need a thing, you know? A hook. Like that guy in the subway who eats his own face. <laughs> so I figure I'll be crazy man with a snake. You know? Crazy snake man. And I'll get more snakes. Call them, my babies. Kids won't walk past my place. They will run. Run away from crazy snake man. No, <laughs> Chef. You've got to get over this, okay? You're not gonna end up alone. Of course I am. I reject anyone who's crazy enough to actually go out with me, and then I bitch about the fact that there aren't any great women out there. Chandler, you have just described virtually every man that we have ever gone out with. Yeah. <laughs> you are not a freak. You're a guy. She's right. You are no different than the rest of them. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yes, he is. Yeah, you are totally different. In a bad way? No, honey, in a wonderful way. You know what you want now. I mean, most guys don't even have a clue. I mean, you are ready to take risks. You're ready to be vulnerable and, and, and intimate with someone. Yeah, you're not going to end up alone. Yeah, Chandler, you called Janice. That's how much you wanted to be with someone. <laughs> You've made it! You're there! You are ready to make a commitment! Whoa, don't know about that. <laughs> oh, what you got there? Something else that's not yours that you can break? <laughs> no, um, I know you like this and I, I want you to have it. I think it'll look good in our apartment. Thank you. Fine. <laughs> hey. hey. Well, you will all be pleased to know that I have a date tomorrow night. Hey. 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 Wow. This woman, Allison, from work, she is great. She's pretty, she's smart, and uh, I've been holding off asking her out in the past because she has a uh, unusually large head. <laughs> but I'm not gonna let that stuff hang me up anymore. Okay. Uh, hey. Look at me, I'm growing. <laughs> Hey, uh, you can't recycle yearbooks, can you? Um, I'll take that. You want his yearbook? Yeah, yeah. Some people said some nice things about him. Think somebody should have it. Oh, gosh, this is so weird. I mean, his whole life was in this apartment, and now it's gone. You know, I think it would be nice if we just took a few moments for Mr. Heckles. I mean, he was kind of a pain. He was, but he was a person. <laughs> <laughs> You're all going to hell. Oh, it's really not that big. Taking that with you, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, you coming? Yeah, in a second. Bye, Mr. Heckles. We'll try to keep it down. Oh, my major was totally useless. I mean, how often do you look in the classifieds and see philosopher wanted? <laughs> sure. My God, that's a big head. <laughs> It didn't look this big in the office. Maybe it's the lighting. My head must look like a golf ball at work. All right, don't get hung up on it. Quick, quick, list five things you like about her. Nice smile, good dresser, big head, big head, big head. 